Hi guys, welcome to another Living in SA TV video, David here. Today we are going to explore Rosebank and see the latest developments in terms of buildings and understand better the 7 billion rand facelift. Don't you believe me? Stay tuned because once again this video will blow your mind. Rosebank is a sophisticated commercial and residential neighborhood on Johannesburg northwestern outskirts. Rosebank, Johannesburg, has an abundance of high-end shopping centers. The zone at Rosebank is one of Johannesburg's most premium shopping districts. The zone at Rosebank is a large mall. There are also many large movie theaters in Rosebank. It has a wide range of hotel options, from inexpensive lodging to more upscale B&B &B lodging. Rosebank has a large number of self-catering chalets, hotels, guest homes and lodges. At the 25th International Design and Development Award ceremony, the zone at Rosebank received a Certificate of Merit. This area was once part of a farm called Rosemill Orchids, which was owned by a Mr. Lorenko. Richard Curry, an auctioneer, was the first to sell plots in the region in 1896. The streets were renamed in 1919 by the city council to honor British admirals during World War I. Rosebank and Dunkel were two of the first suburbs to have trolley bus transport in 1945. Cecil Bierman purchased the southwestern corner of Oxford Road and Tyrewith Avenue. On behalf of a syndicate, construction work began in 1950 and the property was enlarged several times. In due course, he sold out his interests, but the site attracted many other developers and Rosebank became one of the prime shopping areas of Johannesburg. The Swedish architect Max Kirchhofer designed original retail office and high-density residential area bordered by Oxford Road, Jellico Avenue, Jens Smuts Avenue, and Biermann Avenue in 1972. In 1976, the development of a 15 million rand shopping center situated on Oxford Road was initiated. Rosebank Mall, the Fierce and Mutual Square became fashionable shopping areas. Office blocks, including Standard Bank and Johnny Properties, were then constructed by developers. Rosebank, once in the brink of a steady decline, has been turned into a multicultural, vibrant and exciting suburb of Johannesburg with an outdoors atmosphere. It is a trendy suburb, business center and tourist attraction in one of Johannesburg's upmarket suburbs. Although Rosebank is on to many head offices, the district also provides plenty of entertainment to its residents and visitors. And its variety of shopping malls, restaurants, markets, luxurious hotels, cinemas, art galleries and nightclubs. Rosebank attracts literally thousands of people on weekends and public holidays. The elegant suburb of the Mall of Rosebank is the city of Johannesburg's second largest business district. It is a home to some of South Africa's most contemporary stores and adventurous entertaining attractions. Oxford Road was the original name given to the part of this road in Park Town by Mr. O.E. Redwood and the intention was to recall the famous British University. Tyrewith Avenue, formerly 2nd Avenue, is believed to be named after Commodore Sir Reginald. Tyrewith 
of World War I fame. Bolton Avenue was presumably named after the Lancashire town of Bolton. Fourth Avenue was renamed Craddock Avenue, presumably in honor of Rear Admiral Sir Christopher Craddock, who went down with all his crew on the 1st November 1914. Bath Avenue was presumably named after the city in Somerset, England. It was originally Fifth Avenue and only altered on 27th of October 1919. Baker Square was presumably named after Baker Street when this area was developed in 1963. It is a popular and not an official name. Baker Street, Miss Baker, is mentioned as governess to H.B. Marshall's children. She took the children to Natal during the Jameson Raid period and to Europe a little later. Mrs. Nellie Ivory, H.B. Marshall's daughter, in a letter dated 14th of May 1961, stated that the governess was Mabel Hope Baker and that the family had a high regard for her. The assumption is therefore that H.B. Marshall named the street in Melrose in her honor. Jellicoe Avenue was formerly known as the Third Avenue. Admiral Jellicoe was first sea lord during World War I. Rosebank is conveniently situated just 35 minutes from O.R. Tambo Airport and is close to all the major centers of Johannesburg. If you haven't burned up all your energy during the day, then Rosebank offers a range of happening night spots and cocktail bars with live music and DJ spinning beats. You select from hardcore dance spots to more laid-back venues. Situated at the Fierce Catsis is the perfect place for that pre-dinner cocktail or post-dinner cigar. The Who's Who hang out at this trendy venue. The only art house cinema complex in the area, Cinema Nouveau, at the Rosebank Mall, comprises 10 screen offering a stimulating array of art house movies. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next Living SATV video.